So this is the undiscovered country, this next conversation. So as you're looking at this 300 pound person that wants to lose weight, that went out and paid $50,000 to lose weight and never really lost to the point where he originally intended, what does this 300 pound person say to himself every day he's trying to lose weight? I'm fat. I wonder, most people take an hour <laughs> mm -hmm. to figure this thing out. It may be because of the, the conversations that we've had. Most people can't come to that realization that this person through the whole process kept saying this or So the, the fitness industry isn't built on this. It's built on some smart or knowing that these people that we're selling to can constantly tell themselves, I am fat, I am unfit, and I'm not healthy. And I can sell that person tons of shit, and they're never going to arrive at a place called I am fit, or I am skinny, or I am healthy. Mm. So this never changed throughout the whole process because I am fat still says it here. Mm. I am fat can't live in the same position of I am skinny. So this has to seek itself. This declaration statement has to find itself here. It cannot find itself here given the paradigm that people live in. Mm. It's very profound to understand that. Yeah. So what has to happen first? Figure out who you are. Who you are first. How does a 300 person, 300 pound person, figure out who they are first? What does it look at? Who they want to be. So my experience of a th if you're 300 pounds yeah. and you ask them who they are, yeah. what are they going to answer it from, or where are they going to answer it from? Current. Their current state. Yeah. So the world told them who they were, mm. and they agreed to it. That's why they're 300 pounds. It's not intuitive to be able to declare who you are from a place where you are not. Mm. I'm not healthy. I can't run. What do you mean you can't run? I tried. Mm. But that person doesn't say I'm a runner first. It looks for evidence. Mm. So this formula is designed around it needs no evidence to support it. So it only like needs faith, language. Faith based. It could be faith based. Yeah. It only needs language to support it. Mm. because it's designed on filling itself in. So there's a code, my understanding of it, is you're already born with this formula in place. It's just waiting for you to fill it in. Mm. Well, since you don't want to fill it in, you let the world fill it in. Mm. So the, however it gets filled in, it'll, it'll work itself out. It's currently getting filled in here. I am fat. And my goal is to not be fat, which can't happen. Yeah. So I fill in fat with a representative fat. This only represents fat. I'm still fat. Mm. I'm less fat, but I am still, I am fat. Yeah. Or I'm still unfit. And then eventually this gets filled in. I can download, I can Google any plan to be successful, mm -hmm. but I'm not going to carry it out because I don't understand the whole dynamics of the formula. In the Bible, in Genesis, what's the first declaration statement? Which is the power of Genesis. 
what did God's reference in Genesis have? It was in the first few stanzas. That what I am? Well, yeah. I'll get, I'll get to that, but yeah. yeah. So his name was Yahweh, mm -hmm. which is I am that I am. The power of I am that I am. Whoever I say I am, that's who I am. Mm -hmm. So Yahweh, if you replace the word God with Yahweh, mm -hmm. it changes the whole dynamic of how you look at religion. Mm -hmm. Which is a whole other conversation. Yeah. So I am looked at what? He looked at the darkness. the darkness or the void. Mm -hmm. And what, he, what happened then? Do you remember? Right. He said, he declared into the void light. Mm -hmm. There was no light until he declared it. Mm -hmm. So the declaration has to happen without evidence. Mm -hmm. I am light before there is light. Mm -hmm. So I want light. I am light. My goal is to create light. It's different. Now that I've exposed you to this, how you look at a goal will be different. Mm -hmm. It's the power of what I call internal dialogue because I had to name it something. Mm -hmm. This needs to declare itself <clears throat> when there's no evidence to support it. Because the formula doesn't require evidence. It only re requires that you declare something and then you find a way to measure it. Another place that things were declared before there was evidence is the Declaration of Independence. If you understand the condition of the colonies at the time, there was no independence. Mm. You were dependent upon England and actually France too, for everything. They declared independence before they were independent. Mm -hmm. They became, I am independent. And they were, we are now independent of England on September or, or whatever, yeah. 1776. They declared it before there was, it was even possible. Mm -hmm. By declaring it, you create the possibility that it will happen. So this declaration statement has to then have a goal it has to be bigger than itself. You can't have a goal in this formula that is equal to itself. So if you're, if you're already capable of running a 5K, if your next goal is to run the same 5K, it can't work out. Mm -hmm. This thing has to be bigger than this thing. If you don't, if this isn't bigger than this, you will destroy this so that that thing is bigger. So another way of saying that is if I put 5K here as a goal and I'm currently capable of doing it, I have to d declare myself less, which is the real terrible spin that people put on it. I just want to run another marathon, do another marathon. So the person that you say that you are becomes less and less and less and less and less. You don't always have to like run. Create more difficulty to do what yeah. you've already done. Do you have to then say, I'm not really fit? Yeah. And you have to destroy who you are so that the goal is bigger. Hmm. Unless you say, given the conditions that I'm facing now, 5K is huge. When I was just running before I was married and before I made a million dollars, 5K was easy. Now, from the position of a different perspective, dude, running a 5K is like running an ultra marathon. Mm -hmm. If you say it because you recognize that it's ominous, that's also appropriate. Okay. Or if there's like a time parameter. Yeah, or you say, I'm gonna run it in I'm gonna run three minutes faster than 
a 5K every day for 21 days. Yeah. That's now, I can run a 5K in my sleep. I can running it every day for 21 days, that's a Herculean effort. So it declares it from I don't know how. As long as it, literally the experience of the declaration has to occur to you like this. When you sign that document, you're like, I don't see how it's gonna work out. So you have to declare it without any solution that it's possible. Mm -hmm.